Hi everyone, welcome to another cosplay tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use cosplay for planting trees. Now on South Snowfka we have field number 23 and next to field number 23 we have this nice patch of grass. It runs alongside the field and next to the road as well. It feels kind of bare to me so I kind of want to plant some trees in here and I want to show you guys how to do that with cosplay. So let's jump into the tractor, start up the engine and open the cosplay hut which we do by clicking the right mouse button. Inside the cosplay hut we want to go into the fertilizer and seeding mode which is this mode we have right here. And once we're in this mode we have the cost generation button open or active so let's click that one here. Now unlike when we plant a field we don't actually have any predefined area to, to work in here. Now if we had a field let's say that we wanted to plant on field number 23 we can just scroll until we get field number 23 or we can use these up and down arrows out here. But for areas not defined as a field we have to define the area to work in ourselves. So let's scroll away from this one here. And that means that we have to tell Cosplay where to work. Actually it's the same thing as we did when we plowed between the fields here. So let's start the course recording and I'm going to record a course going parallel with field number 23 and parallel with the end down here and then coming back up and then uh, parallel with the end here. So I'm going to define a square for course play to work in. So I'm going to start the course recording in this corner here and I'm just going to make sure that we are somewhat in the corner. And this seems like a fine place. And when you record these courses, remember that Courseplay uses the center of the tractor to define the outer perimeter of the course. And here we go. So we have the start point right at the edge of this area we want to work in. So it's just driving in a straight line all the way to the other end. And I'm going to stick... Um, I'm going to stay a little bit away from the field just to have enough room for machinery when it works on the field not to bump into the trees. I don't want that to happen. So I'm going to give it a little bit of a room, or a little bit of room here to uh, to work in. And once we come down to the end of this grass path here, I'm going to slow down. And let's just have a look. Now Notice how it sets the waypoint uh, kind of center to the tractor. So I'm going to drive up to this point here. It seems about center of the wheelhouse. And uh, press the pause the recording button. And now I'm going to line up the tractor um, to go at an angle, a 90 degree angle here. Like so. And we're just going to go like that. And I'm going to unpause and drive this way here. And that seems like the perfect location, so I'm going to pause again. It's not going to be perfect straight down here, but you know, it's it's the best we got right now. So I'm going to position the tractor again next to the course that we are recording, like that. Unpause and there we have it and just drive straight up or follow the road straight up and this is going to define a nice square area for cosplay to plant the trees in and for any of you out there who has done this job manually you guys will know what a slow boring job this is so it's a perfect opportunity to use cosplay all right so we are getting up to the end now and let's slow down a little bit just to make sure there we go that seems about right let's place a pause and line ourselves up for driving back to the start point of the course here like so oops there we go unpause and back to the start point over here 
there we go I'm gonna stop the course recording now and now we have a well-defined square to work in if we press this button here we can actually see the entire square that we just defined it's not perfectly square but it's very close to square so the next thing we want to do is we want to go into the course generation here and now we have fuel edge path which is the currently loaded course the currently loaded course is the course that we just drove and that's the one that we want to use for defining where to work now the work width of the of this machinery it uh, says that it's 2.4 meters let's have a look at that that seems about right the starting corner now we are not on field number 23 and we need to remember that when we set the starting corner so we want to be starting next to the field which is the southernmost eastern corner so southeast is where we want to start start and southeast there we go and we want to head west I don't really care about returning to the first point it doesn't matter headlands doesn't matter either all I wanted to do is just plant a couple of rows of trees here so if I press the course generation or generate fuel course here you can tell that this one up here is now telling us that it's gonna go four times I believe it is up and down and now we're basically ready to go so one thing that we do need to do now I'm not gonna save this course because I'm not I'm most likely not gonna use it again and if I am gonna use it again it's not particularly hard to record this course but one thing I need to do here is I need to allow create fields so I'm gonna press the Y button here to make this cedar able to plant um, outside of fields all right we should be ready to go so if I press start at the first waypoint and say drive course he's gonna go up to the start point and he's off now as you can tell this is gonna take a very very long time but we are getting trees planted and I've set the helper to actually buy trees so he's not gonna run out of trees anytime soon but you could set up a refill course if you wanted to um, but for the sake of this tutorial I'm not gonna do it right now just gonna let him plant all of this and I am gonna speed up time and let you guys watch this Okay, so the planting is going absolutely great. We are getting a lot of trees from this and we are just approaching the other end of the course that we recorded here. So now he's gonna go down to the end or she's gonna go down to the end and stop the planting and turn around. And here we go we are back heading back up again and there we have the first tree planted in row number two and you know what guys I'm just gonna let this go on uh, for a while and I will see you when it's close to done it's now three billion years later and well through the magic of editing you guys haven't actually been with me on the entire ride but here we are we are getting close to the end of this course and all the trees have been planted um, in a very symmetrical forest here 
uh, I guess I guess us with OCD or OCD tendency well I guess we kind of like it this way anyway uh, the course is just about done and once she's up at the end of the the course course player will notify us that this is done and uh, we can put this tractor away but when we're done with this I'm just gonna magically speed up time and we can watch these trees go grow into a beautiful forest and it will change the landscape a little bit but to set up this course is as simple as this so let me know guys if you have any questions or any comments post them down below and thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.